Hey, how you doing? Dan at Total Restoration Services. Um, we caught up with Renault. He is a busy guy. One of the lead foremen at Total Restoration Services. How you doing, bud? Getting it done? Hi, how you doing? All right. So, a lot of people don't know what you guys do. They go to work in the morning. They see us tearing off the roof, and they come home, and it's done. And it doesn't happen just like that, does it? No. So, when you guys get here in the morning, 6, 6.30, 7 o'clock, what's the first thing you guys, what's the first thing that you do? Uh, we basically get at, at the side job and and they start uh, taking uh, the safe, safety stuff. Uh, to go, okay. To go, like harnesses, every, everyone. So, I have to have a harness to go up to the roof. Good job. And you know what? A lot of places don't do that. They get to the jobs and expect everyone to get on the roof and get to work right away. At Total Restoration Services, as Renault said, they have a little safety meeting. Um, they go over the harnesses on days like, what is it, 90, 85, 90 degrees today? Uh, everyone has to drink water. Uh, safety, safety, safety. Um, what's the next thing, you guys? I'm guessing you're putting ladders and stuff out, or what, what comes next? So the next part we do it, it's uh, getting uh, the whole uh, tools, ladders, and all that. So, and then... Uh, the next thing is make sure everything is covered uh, around the house, uh, put tarps on it, and then make sure the siding doesn't get uh, any uh, anything dark or something like that. No damage, yeah, no dings. Yep, and that's the second part. Uh, and then uh, we go to the, up to the roof and we start tearing up uh, the old shingles okay. and go from there. Take it from there. So at Tall Restoration Services, you, you guys don't just put shingles on top of shingles. We don't do that here, right? No, uh, we basically tear off all the shingles uh, and then make sure when we done tear off, um, the next thing is make sure the, the decking uh, under it's everything uh, good and good, in good condition okay. to start um, putting the, the icy water shields. Okay. Um, on, a, on a all apes around. Okay. And then we start passing uh, with synthetic um, underlaying. Okay. And so after that, uh, the next step is um, put shingles up to the roof. Okay. Using the elevator. And then. Uh, I like the elevator, dude. You know how many bats you got? You probably can see it from where we are. That thing saves a lot of bats. A lot of companies. I'm not going to say don't care about their employees, but, I mean, would you rather have your guys walking up a ladder all day or using this device where it could take maybe one, two, three up at a time? Isn't that, that makes it easier on your backs, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. All right, so the, once the shingles start getting up there, then what, they rip them apart, open up the bags, and start putting the shingles on? Yes, uh, that's the next thing. Uh, we put uh, star strips and then start shingling. Uh, make sure we put um, the... Um, do a fashion, got an apron also, so and they start tingling. Um, okay, and make sure everything goes well. Uh, with the uh, final part, it is um, the reach, reach band or reach, or reach caps, and make sure yep. everything is the last inspection to make sure the job is completely done to not get back to the job and everything is up in that. Gotcha. And the ridge caps you're talking about, I'm guessing that runs right down the middle of the roof up on top? Correct. And those get nailed on just like everything else? Correct. All right. Well, there you go. You know, I thought I knew what I was talking about. Renault is the man. He's got it going on. So I know he's busy. His guys are hard at work. We're going to let him go. Thank you so much for your time, sir. Um, we're going to check back a little bit later. We're going to see how things are doing. Uh, once again, I'm Dan, Total Restoration Services. This is our lead foreman. Thanks again for your time, my friend. Thank you. Remember, we'll see you somewhere. Bye-bye.